Hello everyone and welcome back to Vlogmas Day 6. Today is a very serious job to be done. Today I'm going to conquer the reorganisation and mini clear out. Well, we'll see how mini it is. It, it may end up being a large clear out of my wardrobe. But first of all, I'm gonna have a shower because I feel rank <laughs> and that's gonna make me feel so much better and have a clear mind to conquer this. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna start by taking everything, and I mean everything, out and lying it in piles on the bed. That way I can see exactly how much space I've got and exactly how much of each category I have. Wow. <gasps> And this is the result. Holy moly. So I've got knitwear, cardigans at the bottom, and then sweaters. I've got a whole box of sweaters here. This is my blazer pile. And then this is my jackets pile. So leathers, bikers, and the suede ones at the bottom. This is denim and trousers, which are all mixed in. And then I've just shoved any accessories up there. Now, if we look over in this half, the predicament is that I don't really have enough room for all of my knitwear. So I'm thinking, and I did this last autumn winter, that I'm gonna use these shelves to fold my knitwear because at the moment I've got a lot of it hung and you really shouldn't have knitwear on hangers because it ruins the shape. Right, I have just emptied this entire side now, bar the coats. Now the problem is, is that this side of the wardrobe is the only side that has a bar which is completely uninterrupted all the way down, so there's no bar halfway. So technically this is the only space I can have my coats. So I'm gonna try putting my knitwear in these cubes and hopefully, my bags will be able to fit on the top, but we'll see. Look, there's quite a few. Now, I know that there's some which I don't use. I was gonna say very often, there's some which I don't use at all, like this beautiful Celine that I think I'm gonna sell on Vestiaire and probably this one as well. So not all of them are gonna be going back. Right, sweaters are in. That was probably one of the most satisfying things I have ever done. Now this is where I struggle when I do wardrobe clear out. So these are both aviator jackets. This one is the Me and M one which I spoke about in a vlog. I think it was the one before Vlogmas. It's reversible. It's awesome. But I also have the Zara one which is basically a dupe of the Acne Velo site or Velocity. I don't really know what it's called. Anyway that jacket. Do I really need both is the question. And just as I'm starting to make a real progress with like culling things and being really, really ruthless, this arrives. <laughs> the biggest Topshop delivery you've ever seen. Oh, I'm just getting to that point now where I'm like, why did I even start this? <laughs> but this side's looking good. Look at all the colour coordinated knitwear and look at how those just go perfectly in colour order. Feeling smug but also fed up at the same time. <laughs> okay, on to the handbags. Right, they're in. Look, there's my new Celine, rather gingerly placed in there because I don't want it to get scratched. And then down here, so I have the big Antigona there, my Mulberry and then my uh, Saint Laurent tote bag, it's the red, red leather one in there. So those are all like my large big bags and then up there just my sort of normal everyday crossbodies and sort of medium sized bags. So I feel like today is a relatively successful organisational day, it's really starting to come together now. I'm going to make a start on this side because this side is the one that is the trickiest so we've still got all of this stuff to go through. Okay I've finished the top rail so I've got my kind of short jackets which I moved across from over in that one 
which go into my bikers and then my blazers the three cardigans which I've still got hung I've got some really lightweight knitted tops here which I didn't want to put over in the other one um, and actually these I don't mind hanging so that's fine very very small amount of um, shirts and then a few basics on the end followed by some camis just in case there's ever an evening situation and then now oh this is the one I'm dreading oh and I've got to hammer through this pile of denim and trousers and you guys know how much I love my denim I'm actually so proud of myself look at that I mean wow but look at this rainbow of denim and I think if you remember from how I had it before I had all my denim and my trousers mixed in together I've now separated my non-denims at the end look look at this savage pile of denim that I've just completely vetoed uh what are you doing those are my gloves no I'm gonna put those up there okay thank you for your assistance <laughs> coming back oh and you've brought a friend excellent you're all gonna have a rummage got them in the end did you i thought you were helping to organize yep okay cool bye then right i'm gonna make a start on my jewelry now and i think ideally what i would like is to have each hook organized by brand so I know that I want to get rid of some of these and then just some regular sorting needs going on here. Right, that is all the jewellery done. So on the first two hooks I've got Misoma. So all of these ones on here are all the bobble chains and some of the charms that I've got, including some of the gemstone collection. Then on the second hook, more Misoma and these are like the shorter ones and just the things like the mini fang necklace and the arrows. On the third hook, I've got all of my Cinco pieces. Look at all those. I didn't realize I had so many. Love them. And then the, th wait, what are we on? The fourth, the <laughs> fourth hook is Monica Venada. Uh, this one is, um, oh, these are the pieces from the girl whose Etsy shop I shared with you all um, in a vlog maybe a couple of weeks ago. Um, I'll link that below again. Then this one is just a couple of delicate pieces. This one again was from Etsy. And then this is like a little Leo symbol. That's actually from the Z Accessorize collection. Um, and then these are just some, some random ones. And then this hook on the end is Etsy. And again, a couple of other brands in there as well. Okay, guys, I am very, very happy with how this has all come along today it's all looking so much better however there's one category which is my loungewear which I haven't been able to fit now I do need to go through this pile because there's a lot of stuff here which has got paint on it because I've used it for painting so I can get rid of some but I think I'm gonna have to go through these drawers and try and figure out if there's some space maybe in this one well I am knackered. <laughs> I'm having to sit down on a dining room chair that I've had to bring from downstairs just to reach up in those top cupboards up there. Um, so I'm just having a minute with a mince pie, a mince pie break if you will. And then I've just got the last few bits to finish off. Yeah, it's actually starting to go dark outside. I've been doing this for that long today but I feel so much better. Do you know what the best thing is? Tomorrow when I wake up and I go to get dressed and everything just looks, mm, that's like the best feeling. Okay guys, this room is done, but look at this. This is what I have to look forward to for the rest of the evening. Holy shit. Look at this, this is like a bomb has hit. So this all just completely needs organizing. This is all the stuff that I've culled from today. And so this all needs organizing. I've got some bags up here which are being depopped. Oh my gosh, there's just so much 
stuff to do. Oh, now I've just knocked that over. So yeah, this is the mission for the next few hours. Wow, would you look at that clear floor. I'll show you in here just to, so you guys can see. Look at how organized. Everything's folded. I know that doesn't look particularly organized, but trust me, it is. And you can see the floor in here. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm so happy to sit down. So happy. Right, so I'm all done. It's now 4.27 and I have fully completed the task at hand. I hope you guys enjoyed my little wardrobe cleanse today. And that's it. So I'm gonna crack on with some work now and I will catch you guys tomorrow because it's vlogmas and we're vlogging every day so yeah <laughs> i will see you tomorrow